It's really exciting. There's kind of a, a much bigger breadth of movement that I've been finding. I'm learning more about what the, that movement is being in service of. That's beyond what we can put into just words. The bridge that I am sort of finding between this movement and acting is being able to tell stories and, and communicate an experience. I've been consulting and working with two collaborators as well, two other dancers, Sierra Holder and Maria Cortiras. Together we dove really deep into the story and then bring in the contemporary dance and the movement, which can then just sit a little bit deeper into some specific feelings that just kind of go beyond uh, story and can, and can really revel in a way and explore that physical and emotional knowledge that, that we just can't deny, really. I find movement comes from a much more subconscious place. And you don't have to be a dancer to, if you can let go into that, your body will move how it wants to. There's so many different things that I can do with this one movement to expand upon and really make a lot that's digestible and, and visceral out of that initial feeling of what it is. Guelph Dance has been supporting in like a beautifully balanced way. Katrina will check in with me just to make sure things are going okay or kind of logistic things like space and resources and um, this beautiful mentorship fund. And at the same time, they also have very much sort of planted the seed of support and kind of built this framework and support system that's very clear and set out so that they can kind of let me, like a like cocoon, like a little caterpillar, and they say, okay, go do your thing. And just sort of let me go through that and trust that I'll kind of, you know, come out a butterfly or like blossom on the other side. Mm -hmm.